What's going on, y'all? It is Spicy AF, and I'm back outside with another spicy topic. Please hit that thumbs up, like this video. Also, follow me on other social media platforms. I'm on Twitter, I'm on Instagram, Spicy AF on all platforms. Here's my picture. Subscribe and share. Sadly, this shouldn't even be a topic anymore, but K. Michelle was speaking and asked if Rashida, who also casted in Love and Hip Hop Atlanta about 2012, somewhere along those lines, with K. Michelle, has she ever apologized for what she said in not believing K. Michelle's story of her horror story of an ex, former executive producer of Jive Records, Memphis Bleak, who beat her up, suffocated her and threatened to harm her son. Take a look at what Rashida said to the comments who was asking after Sukiyana had put in reference. Did Rashida ever apologize or she should apologize? Y'all take a look at Rashida's response to that. Please come about my live with the but I love you guys. Anyway, so, <laughs> um. I'm gonna go visit my grandmother and that's that. But I love my honey. We're here and we're ready to do a little shop. Just talking to Terrible then. Like, I'm not apologizing. I'm not doing none of that. Balls and that. <laughs> yeah, doing all that. Okay. Okay. So what? No, I wanna know. What's the normal? Well, if you tell a dumb <laughs> go back and go look at the fing <laughs> reunion when you did apologize, they'll shut the up. Oh my god, somebody said their aunt is 102. Oh wow. That is beautiful. That's amazing. That is nothing See, but a blessing. And you know what I said? I don't care about stuff like that. What I care about is my grandmother me. being 96. Right, and they need to I do that. Look, there they go. I don't know. It should have just been a positive follow up instead of it being what she just did. Because that to me was just very dismissive and she don't care and she's not if she does feel empathy Rashida's still not showing that she cares girl what girl what so eight years ago the court found that Memphis was actually guilty he actually admitted to fighting with K Michelle K Michelle had even pictures I remember seeing photos of how she looked so I don't get what I don't get why there's even a question like I said this situation shouldn't even be a topic really but this goes to show how the manipulator moves how the liar the deceiver move how the abuser how the abuser moves after he acts on the abuse uh, hey, since you were trying to you know, tell a lie on me that she told me she was like I'm about to hit you where it hurts if you think you're about to get married on me and all this, so once she told that lie on TV, I didn't really respect the fact of what a lie on TV meant at the time, because at the time, I'm like, I'm industry famous. Mm -hmm. At the time, I'm industry, like, in the music industry, yeah, I'm famous. Everybody knows me, so I'm telling her, like, everybody knows me, you know, everybody knows me, that ain't how I, I roll with, with the ladies, you know, that ain't how I roll with women, so but she's like, no, nah, I'm, I'm about to tell people to hit me, mm -hmm. and I was like, ain't nobody believing that. So when she said it on TV, people did believe that. Yeah. And I had to start and I had to deal yeah. with the repercussions and I, I was not ready for all that. Mm -hmm. So let's like set the record straight. Yeah. <clears throat> so did you hit Kevin I never in my life touched that crazy. Lady. <clears throat> never in my life touched that girl. Lady. That's what you call her. She is crazy. <laughs> findings that he was in the wrong y'all what he tried to do was he tried to counter sue for defamation just just like we just talked about with um the former nba player darius morris just like we talked about with kiki palmer's ex darius jackson dalton whatever his name is we just talked about him too these men try to counter sue when these women take the steps just like we just we just talked about all this guys we've been talking about this situation of abuse for months now they try to defend themselves after people find out who they are and they drag them for filth the men they tried then that tactic to say no it was the woman she was she was out here hitting me this never happened but k michelle provided proof to the court that in fact Memphis, 
he did threaten her son to K word her son y'all he threatened her um, so yeah there's a lot of evidence going with that leave your comments let me know what you think hit that thumbs up y'all subscribe and stay tuned